In today's video I want to expose animal abuser Aaron Luce for being an irresponsible father putting his child in a very dangerous situation. I've already exposed this in one of my videos but I feel the need to make this video on its own because this is really troubling. This anti-vegan hunter doesn't seem to care about his children's safety. The video I will be talking about is called Bushing Inferno. I'm only going to show snapshots and not the whole video in case Aaron gets his sensitive feelings hurt and tries to give me a copyright claim again. As always, I censor his kids' faces because unlike Aaron, I have respect for them. A little more on this later. As you can see, there's a blowtorch heating up a metal rod on the ground. Aaron allows his young daughter to smack the metal rod with a wrench several times. She's barefooted, no gloves and no protective eyewear. Why is Aaron allowing her to do that in the first place? This is extremely dangerous regardless how old you are. You don't smack metal objects that are scorching hot with no protective gear. Can anyone who's a mechanic, does construction or welding of some sort, vouch for this being okay? Again Aaron allows her to do this. It's not like she went up and started hitting the hot metal without him knowing that was her intention. Back to Aaron filming his kids. I know if I was a father I wouldn't shove a camera in front of my children's faces and record them, to be put up on a channel that I troll on without their permission. Yes, I do know he does this without their approval. He's scared to show his family the videos he uploads about me because he doesn't want them to see my videos I've made about him. He always ignores this fair criticism because he never addresses it. I already proved Aaron doxed his own family without a care in the world. At the same time I told him not to do it because I cared about his family's safety. How come Aaron and his couple followers never bring any of this up? Was it right for Aaron to let his daughter hit that burning metal rod with no safety gear? Was it right for Aaron to dox his family because he doesn't care? Is it right for Aaron to film his children and upload them on his channel he trolls on without their approval? It's ludicrous how his followers don't criticize Aaron for this. Instead, they stay silent and ignore my fair criticism because they know I'm right. It's too hard to defend Aaron's immature actions. He's a disgusting human being. I've shown a lot of respect for his family. Not for Aaron because I don't care about his feelings. I've taken the time to blur out his children's faces because they are innocent. I care about their privacy while Aaron uses them as open targets for other people who troll back at him to address Aaron calling me being obsessed with him. Of course I am. I never denied that I wasn't. I fully admit it. Why? Because I'm an anti-vegan channel. I'm obsessed with any anti-vegans. I'll make 100 or 1000 videos of him. At least I have a valid reason. Aaron's the one denying he's obsessed with me. Look at how many response videos he made towards me. Not including the ones I caught him deleting. Aaron called me a little soy boy kid, while he's a middle-aged man with a family. What's his excuse? I would have never came after Aaron if he wasn't obsessed with vegans in the first place, trolling on their channels. The key is him being obsessed with vegans first. Stop denying your obsession with me Aaron. It's embarrassing for you because you're supposed to be the mature father and husband who should walk away and ignore me. I'm just a little soy boy kid. How about I demand that you show your family my channel or even your channel, so they can see why you're getting triggered by someone named. Carnism is cancer. I triple dog dare you. Do my bidding. I own you. Aaron Luce. Your soul is mine. Carnism is cancer.